as I hold the office of Mayor for the City and County of San Francisco. Mayor for the City and County of San Francisco. He brought decency and really love to his service. And I want people to remember that, not only what he did, but what he stood for, what he meant. My dad was a behind the scenes guy. He never really sought uh, public attention in that way. And so when he decided to run, I do believe to this day that's probably one of the bravest decisions he's ever made. Um, because he didn't want to run because he wanted to be in the spotlight. He wanted to run because he felt that he really could make a difference. He knew more about this city than Newsom, Brown, Agnos, Jordan, and Feinstein combined. When I became a member of the Board of Supervisors and accompanied him on a trip to China, just how he was treated in China, uh, like a rock star, it was insane. Many people, when they're taking a look at the first Asian American mayor, uh, first Chinese mayor in San Francisco, it's important to say not only that he was that, but that he was also a great leader for the city. And he's not just an Asian American leader, he was the leader for San Francisco. He was very genuine about you know, being around for, for things that mattered, uh, things that I was involved in, not just you know on the court, but off the court too. I would hope that people who are leading San Francisco, not only now, but in the years to come, <laughs> might stop and ask themselves, what would Ed Lee do? Uh, maybe make up a little bracelet which says that, because that will help keep them on the right track. They might have disagreed with Ed, they might have had a different idea than he did, but nobody could doubt his deep humanity, his decency, and his love for San Francisco.